Moments with C.S. Lewis. Middle knowledge. From his book, Beyond Personality. Another difficulty we meet regarding God outside of time is this. Everyone who truly believes in God believes that he knows what you and I are going to do tomorrow. But if he knows I'm going to do so and so, how can I be truly free to do otherwise? Hasn't free will just vanished? Now again, the difficulty comes from us thinking that God is moving along the timeline in the same way that we do, that the only difference is that he can see ahead and we can't. Well, if that were true, then yes, it would be very hard indeed to understand how we couldn't be free to do whatever we choose instead of just what's known. There is an idea, however, that's helped me a lot. It's called Molinism, or middle knowledge. If it doesn't help you, just leave it alone. It's a Christian idea, but you can be a perfectly good Christian without accepting it or without thinking about the matter at all. In Molinism, or middle knowledge, the idea is this. What actually happens is God has an omniscient knowledge of every eventuality. So, you are free to choose your course of actions. But he knows the outcome of all your choices, of every eventuality. He knows the outcome of the choices you choose, and he knows the outcome of the choices you decline. He remains omniscient, you retain free will. Makes sense, would you agree? (laughs) 